Good evening, this is Tina. In this video, we're going to talk about how to read the post data using vanilla Node.js API. When we go through uh, more videos uh, after when we talk about uh, Express, in Express, it also has a other ways to handle that. We will have some uh, middlewares like a body parser to parse the post data, which is much convenient than we are doing now. And also how to handle for multi-part. Suppose we want to have a form which is upload some uh, PDF file, image files, and uh, how to do that. There are also other middleware uh, in NPM, uh, that uh, registry, like uh, Busboy, Mo Mo Mortar, uh, Promise, okay, Promise or Promise, okay, I couldn't remember that one. Anyway, the one you are learning now, probably you will not use in the future okay because it has a better solution than this one okay than the vanilla api but it's good to know now okay so now let's go to our source code so first to save our time what i did is uh, first when uh, i create a server here and when it go to our root okay it will display a form okay let me show you now Yes, and uh, if I go here, and now if I go to slash, it will go to this form. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I will type Tina here and click the send. It should give us the some respond, right? Which means on the server side, I have to get the value of uh, Tina, right? So, uh, how to do that is first we have to handle this uh, uh, router okay uh, which is else if you are equals equals where does it post where does it post you can inspect the element and uh, it's a post method the action is a slash message oh i have three s here uh, this is interesting okay let me remove one okay message so it's gonna go to this one slash message and we can do is and which is the method equals post okay method i retrieved from here it will if it's get it's gonna give you get if a post it's gonna give you a post equal okay and if it's inside here then we're gonna do yes to handle our grab information right to grab information here i will create a body okay because the information in our post is inside the body right so we're listening to the event on the request gonna have a data event and the data have gonna give a piece of a chunk suppose your data is huge right so it's gonna send you a piece by piece okay chunk by chunk which is each buffer then i using push the chunk into our body and then if listen to an event which means when when everything is done okay so which means all the information i've done from this uh, request okay then gonna have also have a callback in the callback what you can do is like a, a const uh, body data okay equals we can using buffer because each chunk is a buffer okay we can using buffer dot concatenate okay this body concatenate them together then we convert to be a two string okay and then we console dot log body uh, data and uh, we are yes uh, and we give a down here okay so what is this about the data the body data gonna contains key value pair the key what's the key key is a value for this name attribute the value gonna be uh, the thing we type in the browser so let's take a look at this one scroll and here I will say uh, miss xing send 
and take a look at here take a look at see a message what is where is this message come from the message is come from this one this part the value of the name attribute and the miss xing is from what we typed and in the browser we see the done so this is the vanilla api how to read the you know how to read this uh uh, information from the post request in the body which is not that good because uh, eventually it's gonna turn into a what's thing a string entire string suppose we have a multiple suppose here uh, let's let's do one more here suppose here I have another one suppose let's using this one to be username okay and this one we're using password okay and then you are gonna have multiple key value pairs okay and here let's tina xing send you will see your name tina password it's gonna be a string and you have to process it okay so anyway um we will learn better ways in the future videos okay so that's it for this video and the source code is in the description thank you for watching see you next time bye bye